Hi, my name's Wayne and I've been with the Major Crash Investigation Unit for 27 years. Over that time I've investigated hundreds of crashes where people have died. They're all bad, but the ones that stay with me probably the longest are ones that involve passengers and in particular children. Uh, we did one recently where um, a, fa a family, mother and three children, died in a car accident and it's very difficult to deal firstly with young children in a wreckage and then going to tell a father that their entire family has been destroyed. The problem with children being involved in accidents is that they are trusting of the adults driving the cars and sometimes that trust is not upheld by the driver and through no fault of the child they become the innocent victim in the consequences of the driver and that's the hard part for I think any investigator to deal with is that break in innocence. When we arrived at the scene of the accident, um, I don't think any of us really had a full grasp of what was to lay ahead of us. Um, we saw the two damaged vehicles, we knew that there were children involved, but um, to then go up to the vehicle that the children were in and see how they were in the car um, was particularly hard for me and for everybody that was there because they just looked so innocent and basically asleep um, and then we had to look after them as well as ensuring that um, the father was made aware of the, what had happened as quickly as we could as well. A lot of people put their trust in your ability to control your car and to drive it safely and responsibly. It's not just about you the driver. It's about so many other people, um, family and friends and people that may not even know you that um, are caught up in with the consequences of your poor decisions. Um, stopping to have a rest instead of trying to push through to the destination. Um, have respect and, um, and be with the trust that the people put in you to drive responsibly to get them to their destination and home again safely.